Hello friends, welcome to our channel. In this video, I am going to explain another C program to display the factors of a given number. First, we will see what is the methodology to get the factors of a number. Consider an example number. I am taking 8. I am taking another number 2. Whether 2 is a factor of 8 or not. To get the answer, divide this 2 with 8. If the remainder value is 0, then we can say that 2 is a factor of 8. Now, my question is, I want all the factors of 8. For this, you have to begin with 1 and continue up to 8. Check each and every number from 1 to 8 is divisible by 8 or not. For example, 8 mod 1. If this remainder is equal to 0, then we can say that 1 is a factor of 8. If 8 mod 2 is equal to 0, then we can say that 2 is a factor of 8. From this, 8 mod 1 is a factor. 8 mod 2 is a factor because the remainder is 0. 8 mod 3 is not a factor because the remainder is not 0. 8 mod 4 is equal to 0. This is a factor. 8 mod 5, it is not a factor. 8 mod 6 is not is equal to 0. 8 mod 7 is not is equal to 0. And 8 mod 8 is a factor. So, in this case, what I am doing in a programming point of view, I will store this 8 in a number variable. I will store these values in i variable that will be iterated from 1 to 8 here 1 to number this is a simple logic for i is equal to 1 to number that means start from 1 and to 8 for each and every number if number mod i equal to equal to 0 that means here number is 8 this 8 mod i is initially 1. If it is 0, then print i, then print 1. Otherwise, go and increment the i value. Next i value is 2. Similarly, number mod 2 equal to 0, then print 2. Again, increment the value. i is equal to 3 now. Number mod 3 is not equal to 0. So, here we are not going to print this value, just increment the i value. This is the logic behind this program. And another case, I want to count how many number of factors are there. When you are printing, you can just count here. If 8 mod 1 is equal to equal to 0, then print i along with you just count the value. Initially, I will take account value c is equal to 1. If there is a factor found, then increment the count. And here also increment the count. Here also increment the count and here also increment the count so that we will get count value as 4. Now let us write the program. So the first line is you can do the some documentation author m sudhaka and the program program demonstrates on a C program to display the factors of a number. You can also write header files at the beginning, hash include stdio.h. We have another header file, hash include console io.h. Void main function. Now I have two variables, one is number and you can take i value that is initialized with one. If you want any additional variables, we can declare it later. Print f of enter a number. This will just display the string enter a number in the console. Scan f percentage d, it is an integer type. Am percent number. I am reading the value here. The logic here, I am going to write logic for 
i is equal to 1 begin with 1 i less than r equal to number increment the i value for each number i equal to 1 to number what you have to do here if this number mod i equal to equal to 0 then printf of percentage d if you want slash n you can write slash n comma print the i value this is the program here i am going to print all the factors save this program factors select as c file save the file compile the program if you have any errors now errors will be displayed here there are no errors execute the program if i enter a number 8 now we are getting the factors are 1 2 4 8 let's compile this and test 24 number so we have 1 2 3 4 6 8 12 and 24 these are the factors of 24 now i want to count how many number of factors are there so for this just declare another variable here count is equal to 1 this will begin with 1 here if number mod i equal to equal to 0 then we are printing the factor here you just increment count plus plus or you can write count is equal to count plus 1 after this for loop i am printing printf of the total number of factors percentage d comma we have count value count save the program compile it and execute it enter a number 8 now here we are getting the total number of factors are 5 why 5 here actually i have taken count value is 1 take the count value from 0 then it will start counting from 1 that is for the first factor count will be incremented by 1 2 3 and so on compile the program run the program 8 now we are getting factors are 4 we can also write another program by doing a small change in this program the program here is display the numbers from 1 to n other than the factors the question is i don't want the factors other than the factors all the numbers should be displayed so in this case the complete logic is same if num mod i equal to equal to 0 then we can consider this as a factor now i will do instead of is equal to i will place not is equal to now this program will print other than the factors save the program compile the program and execute the program enter the number 8 then you will get 3 5 6 7 these are not factors of 8 and the count is here also 4 here 4 numbers are not divisible by 8 this is the way of displaying the factors of a given number if you have any queries please comment in the comment section thank you for watching